Thomas, uh, thank you very much for your time this morning here at uh, Black Expo. Uh, quite interesting to see this automated um, bending machine, shall we call it here. Uh, this is the multi-bend centre. Just talk us through what we're going to see in a minute and some of the advantages to having this sort of setup. Yeah, for sure. Happy that you are here and we can show and demonstrate our multi-bend centre. So please have a look. Okay, so what's going to, just talk us through before we hit the foot pedal, what's going to happen on this whole process? What's, uh, what's, what's going to happen? Um, this part will be measured on three points. So we have the exact position of the sheet here. These grippers will transport the part to this uh, line. The manipulator clamps it, position and rotate to all sides. And after this, it will be unloaded on this side. OK, let's do the process and then let's go around the front of the machine. So uh, when, when you're ready, press start. Yeah. Ah, so the infrared here is measuring. It yeah. just measured where the location is. Now it's mm -hmm. putting the part in the right place. And what's that? Is that a suction? Um, no, this is just a... By clamping, uh, it's uh, with so air it's clamped pressure. top yep. and bottom, yep. and it's moved into the machine. Okay, let's go around the front here. Now we can see the sheet is uh, in the bender, and the process is happening. All happening automatically as well. Yes, for sure. Yeah. Also, now the repositioning of the manipulator will be done. Open position, the other side here. Positive, negative bends are possible. So, in it, it, I mean, this has taken the, the operator out of this process entirely. Normally you'd have to uh, bend, turn the sheet round, bend the other, and you've got to make sure you're in the right position and all that. It eliminates all of that. Yeah, exactly. So here the operator just press start and load and unload the sheet. Yeah. Uh, so everything is done automatically. And, so and what about the, the, the tools here as well? Um, you're going to be changing the tools as well, I believe, aren't you? The tools are uh, also changed automatically. Yeah. Here we need a free space, left and right, you can see. For this sequence, yeah, we use the upper beam tool for, clamping, uh, for closing uh, the hem. Yeah. And where, I mean, I'm, 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 it's an amazing amount of time. You're sat here we can see the tools changing here as well then. So now we're moving on to the next operation and we've changed the tools. Yeah, exactly, that it fits to this length, yeah. Normally, if possible, we bend uh, the short before long side, so no tool change will be necessary, which saves more time, yeah, if you have a machine like this. So every second, uh, yeah, it should be saved. The, the whole solution here, the automation and the, uh, the press brake, is this all of your product? Is everything yours, or are um, you a systems integrator? Um, no, the machine is ours, okay, here the computer are things we, we buy. Yeah, but, I mean, uh, let's talk about this, how, how, how on earth do you begin to start planning the programming around this sort of part, is it easy to do? Um, yes, for sure, yeah, in terms of smartphone and tablet, normally everybody has a 3D model, if it's a step file, for example, yeah, you load this part and yeah, put it in the software, it will be analyzed and the machine will make uh, yeah, a ranking of all the possibilities how to bend and create this part. So it will even help you to generate the program to the most effective and efficient way. Yeah, yeah. exactly. And right, well, let's walk around this way again, because I want to just look at the, uh, the finished product here. So this is really, this is, this is what we've just made. Yeah, yeah. This, is, this is the finished, the yeah, finished part. We'll let the camera get close yeah. to that. Now, if you imagine something like this, if you did this without the automation, it, it would take, oh, well, there's dozens and dozens of operations, isn't there? There's dozens of times of, of moving the, the sheet round to, for, for different folds. How much time do you think the saving is doing it like this as opposed to doing it more manually? Well, it depends which kind of machine you choose. Yeah, we have semi-automatic machines. We have machines where you have to attach every step, so you can count the steps. You, yeah, they are, I think, round about 40 bending steps and cycles. And this one is also shown on the the on, on a manual saw machine. The manual, yeah, yeah, how yeah. many seconds this part will take, and so I think, yeah, it's approximately 15 minutes. Yeah, yeah you can save between. 
other machines, yeah? Uh, yeah? Absolutely, at least, wow, never seen anything like this. I've seen plenty of press brakes, I've seen plenty of automation solutions, putting the two together to even change the tools as well. Wow, great stuff here at uh, Black Expo. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you very much.